Welcome to KGB Plays, Workers and Resources, Soviet Republic. Let's get started. Christoph, Kailinka, and Ulyov were meeting again. This was a follow-up to the Vraska crisis. Christoph began the meeting. Ulyov, thank you for getting heat on in Vraska so quickly. You saved a lot of lives. Ulyov replied, my, my pleasure, Christoph, but I can't take all the credit. I only made sure everyone doing the work had what they needed. Which brings me to my next ask, Christoph said. I'd like you to coordinate the building of two monuments, one for the 34 people we lost and one for the workers that toiled selflessly. It would be an honor, Ulyov said. Consider it done. Very good. Thank you, Christoph responded. Now, Kalinka, what were you able to find out about the cause of the error? Well, Kalinka said, I've not been able to confirm, and I think it will be next to impossible to say for sure, but I believe it was one of the last things Alina did before her embezzlement scheme was discovered. Pardon me, Kristoff all but shouted. Alina? I thought we were done with her. Can you explain, please? Kalinka took a deep breath and said, I checked our plans, the PO, and the shipping documents. They don't add up. We planned for large heating pipes ordered large heating pipes, and were delivered materials for small heating pipes. There's only one explanation for it. Alina was somehow able to forge a PO to the supplier and pocketed the difference. I checked with them, and their system shows the order for small heating pipes. That's tantamount to murder, Kristoff exclaimed. I can't imagine anyone doing that. I'll talk to the authorities about the situation and see where we go from here. Kalinka said, just so you know, I confirmed that our new procedures would not allow something like this to happen again. Very good, Kailinka, Kristoff continued. Can you see to setting up a trust account for the affected families? I want to make sure they're taken care of. Kalinka rep replied, I'll see to it. Ulyov, she continued, perhaps we can get Ludmila involved in the monument project. She has a way. I was thinking the same, Kailinka, Ulyov said. I'll speak to her tonight. That evening before falling asleep, Kristoff said to Kailinka, She still haunts me. Hi, Cheap here. Welcome to episode 76. Hope you're having a great day. So, I was talking with Dennis again and uh, did a little, a few tweaks to uh, the OBS recording stuff. So, hopefully, I've got the, uh, <clears throat> the funky noises that pop in from time to time sorted out. Um... We'll see what happens. I've done a couple of things. Uh, one of them seemed to help, and then another one that I'm just sampling or, or trying in, uh, in this uh, recording session should help as well. So we'll see what happens. I'll uh, post on uh, Uliki's Discord uh, what my findings were, and uh, I'm trying out a new stopwatch or uh, timer uh, situation. It's a little easier to deal with because I don't have to deal with my desktop, but Fitbit watch that I have uh, on my wrist actually has a countdown, so it'll uh, it'll warn or tell me when uh, the hour is up. So hopefully that works out. Um, looks like we've got our kindergarten online now, so that's that's cool. Uh, I think we have coverage in this half of the city. <laughs> hopefully, no, I don't. Um, yeah, so I guess what I'm looking at is. Building a uh, footpath right over here. Bes oh. That doesn't look very good, does it? Flip through. Well, I guess I'm going to have to leave that for the time being. Let's see if we can get something to come through here. Should be okay. Other half of that connected up. I want this one to be straight this way as I can. Get the road gangs on these. So all my fussing and fretting about whether or not this was going to be uh, <laughs> something that I need needed the crossover. One side to the other. I mean, short of you know, 
building another kindergarten from this side. Okay, well, I guess we're doing that. I'd forgotten all about this side. So now we have a freshly minted cross crosswalk here. Um, whether it's needed or not, I'm not sure, but it's in and planned. We can just go from there. Um, next thing that I need to... Oh, it looks like we got all our materials. I know we checked that before, but I just had to make sure that... Uh, oh. okay, what am I trying to do? 0.42. It's not much. Not much at all, but we've got a bunch of flatbeds on the way, and I'm guessing that they're carrying a lot. Oh, prefabs. Steel. Steel. Prefabs. Okay, there we go. Electronic components and electronic. So we should be good for the next little bit. And I'm hoping we've got, excuse me, folks on their way. We do. Good. good. Okay. So, any, I didn't see in the comments uh, from the last episode anything that uh, anyone making any guesses as to what my next faux pas was going to be. Um, just checking because there's something that I wanted to take care of. I'll just be a second here. Sorry, for I was supposed to get this organized and I didn't because it was not great. So, um, it was TG Maker that uh, pointed out my uh, one of <laughs> my uh, my mess ups. If you remember correctly or remember from back then. When I had the, the small pipe was in here, it wasn't even actually connected up here. So I just wanted to clear that up. So it was TG Maker. Thank you for, for pointing that out, even though I doubted you and I shouldn't have. So cool. Um, yep, we got plenty of fuel here. So that's nice. And who's delivering our fuel? Yeah, I think that's all dealt with. Sorry. Getting my save games mixed up. Um, looks like we're... Producing, we have chemicals, some chemicals here now. This is obviously not enough. <clears throat> how do I, how do I manage that? That's the next question in my mind, anyway. Oh, there's some aluminum, 137. That's nothing to sneeze at, quite honestly. But again, it's not a mission critical situation. Let me go check here and see. Yeah, we do have four ve four vehicles queued up to deliver. We can just let this run and see how uh, how it works out. We may have to take other steps somewhere along the line. Uh, I know we we can bring them in here uh, by train, uh, but the problem is is we don't have access to that building by road. So <laughs> yeah, well, I mean, and that was a conscious decision at the time and uh, somewhat uh, foolish one. Truth be told, um, we'd certainly get the quantity that we need, and then if if I'd been smart enough to uh, to build that uh, that in here, uh, that would have been a much better way to, to manage it. I think we're bringing chemicals in here by yeah, the truck, so that's uh, again. <laughs> Probably the only thing that that uh, uh, distribution office is dealing with. So, um, yeah, let me go find a, at least uh, a train solution for this one, and uh, we'll go from there. So, um, oh, you want out? Back to your workplace. Thank you. We got one half dealt with here. And I think once that happens, then we can uh, we can fix the uh, fix fix or change the signaling here so that it's no oh, way in. Yeah, and the way in is on the wrong track. 
course. Or I make this the way in and this the way out. And then I have to leave the crossovers, both those crossovers in place. Until that's it's built. Oh, now I need to figure out why. track builder. That's why. So you're going home. I'm just... This is not the best way in here. Running to complete this, obviously. It's going to be a situation for a time as well. But like I said, if I can if I can turn this track into the one way in, then at least we're going to minimize some of those uh, situations. Okay, he's getting out of there now. Okay, um, get the second piece built, and then we can get back on. Well, <laughs> somewhat normal uh, kinds of work and i think we have our, our uh, helicopters all dealing with this stuff let me check to make sure yeah, we may as well get this dealt with need that that's being built this one needs to be built by roads uh, so we need need a road here built here we're building the inside one how do you get there from the other side must be oh that's going to be a long way around I think that's our only option at this point though Okay, let's get the helicopters. Helicopters, there we go. Back on all of these roads. No, it's not necessarily a situation of we have to have this right now. But uh, if it's done, it's done, right? I think that piece is all done all the way up that way. And this one will be all the way down here. So get our mechanisms on there. Okay, I said I was going to do some. <laughs> uh, where are we here? Chemical delivery. Right, that's just over here. And while I'm dealing with that, I'm going to wind be tree planting mode okay be tree planting mode disengaged okay so who is picking up chemicals from here uh yeah, that's our, our truck. And supply export. So you do a little bit of everything. You're, uh, exporting. Well, we're not exporting chemicals, but we are picking up chemicals. Where are we dropping chemicals? Okay, that's for our sh shipbuilding. Or no, that's for uh, shipbuilding. I don't think chemicals are needed. They're fabrics, I don't think. Yes. Okay. So let's get them delivering down to, <clears throat> to 
here. How busy are you? 11? Yeah, that's not bad. You unloading chemicals. And based off of how much can be stored here, yeah. We won't need the full the full meal deal, so 30% is going to be more than enough for them. Yeah, the secret police, something else I need to deal with. And Lalona, small distro. I think I can, I think I know I can. The aluminum plant, alumina plant, yes, you can stop delivering there. Should help with some of the load. <clears throat> okay, that's dealt with. Now, let's see if we've got any blocking situations. Look at that. We do. Um, I don't think turning you around is a good idea. We're going to have to wait <laughs> for... There we go. Oh, this is going to be a little bit of a painful little thing here. Trying to get uh, this last piece dealt with. Maybe I send them all back here for the time being. Just to get that crossover dealt with. Or, the other option, he's on his way. Let's give him one more chance. <laughs> one more chance. <laughs> to uh, set this straight. And if that doesn't cooperate, then <clears throat> we will invoke the emergencies measure, emergency measures. There we go. Probably check on the uh, happiness of our... Uh, Or people in Vraska as well. And I see we're overall we're, we're up to 96%. So. Check this. Oh, that's a... There's somebody in there. Somebody had it. Should be good now. Will you get down there in front of anyone coming out? Nope. Did not happen. This is like timed perfectly, right? Let's go to normal speed. This is carbon copy time. Okay. Um, there you go. I'm way past wanting to even have anything to do with this anymore. There we go. Need to pause while I mess around with signals. This will be this way. This is that way. This way. That way. And now that should force them coming in on this track. I'm going to have to do this as well. Same thing here force them out that way and then this should make life a little simpler here in here back out here and two way here and then everything should be hunky dory right I'm gonna run with that because it starts screaming if I don't. Okay. Let's see if this works now. Or if I can assign. Should be able to assign. Huh. 
I, sh I should be able to assign. Ah. Okay, what have I done with these signals? Should, this should be just fine. Should be able to get onto that track without problem. This is all double double signaled. Double signaled, and here's a crossover that lets you get onto that track. Down here. Wonder if it's this signal that's causing them grief. in games okay yeah it was that signal okay I'll get you the one build it please and they're also working up here if I'm not mistaken and it looks like I am Oh yeah, I know that there's this open. Yes, this is the section that we need for. <clears throat> oh, that's the electrification of all of this rail. Okay, I think if I zoom in close enough, has been done here. Okay, and that's the electrification there. Those are set to be electrified. Okay. Not losing my mind completely. But it would be very nice to get a couple of trains in here working. There's one, there's two. Good. Excellent. And we have our second kindergarten. Now they can walk. Ooh can only go interesting <clears throat> where's my path through here not done yet no it's done let's see oh yeah that's just not uh, not close enough so we needed that one anyway that I needed to have 300 and some odd people working here for the potential for no 600 We'll, uh, oops, we'll put that about half, so I don't think we need nearly that many people dealing with that situation. And here comes our first track builder. Let's, yeah, let's see, let's see, let's see. Are you going to manage it? Shouldn't honestly be a problem because they should always come in on that track, which is the the same side so they won't be blocking any of the metros that are trying to run back and forth over there yay very good I said before, I'm pretty sure this is all set up. Uh, good to go. Do we have fuel here? We do have fuel here now. It means we've got power there. Good. I think our helicopters are working on this one. All the resources, which means we probably need people one in right there people in here and people on the main line it's all built I think I realized part of 
all these mistakes that I'm made in, making is that when I plan an area out, I typically plan everything. And oh, I, I, haven't, I haven't planned everything here. And I didn't plan everything in one go when I put uh, Raska together, I did. I did some of the, the core pieces and then uh, placed some buildings and then did some footpaths and then came back and didn't have very good connectivity for the footpaths, didn't have uh, all of the buildings that were needed, didn't notice the... <laughs> I uh, built the wrong heating pipe. So I think that's, I mean, that's part of my, the way that I approach making, you know, putting, putting new cities or, or uh, factory areas together, those kind of things can try to plan everything out. And uh, from a city perspective, I, I, I typically just start from this side. What do I need here? Sometimes I'll do the, the residential buildings last, but what do I need? You know, I need a store. Uh, I need a, a pub in this case. Uh, I need some culture and I need some sport. And then I go, okay, I've got all that stuff planned. Um, on to the next one. Okay, we need a hospital, uh, et cetera, et cetera. You get the idea. Um, so... <laughs> by not doing that uh, I find it very easy for me to to overlook things that that I need need to have for a city to function properly I don't know if that's the way uh, you approach it um, please let let me know if if that's something that uh, that you do or if you have a different way uh, of, of, of dealing with that because I'm I love seeing and, and finding out all the different uh, different ways that uh, we can approach our, our building situations and uh, and uh, try to have a different kind of fun with uh, with all our uh, Soviet republics that we that we build. And it's still in progress. Looks like we're getting some people. We've got some mechanisms on the roads again, so that's nice. Looking forward to see March to make sure that everybody knows where they need to go. Um, I'd really like to get this power dealt with. But we can't do it until this is built. They don't have a way to get a road in here. Another brilliant... Uh, well, maybe I connect there. No, I'm quite sure that's not going to get connected up anytime soon. Can I can I sneak one out this direction? Oh, I can. Okay. If I run this down here, put a footpath in. You're not going to want to go that way, are you? Okay. We'll do something else. Well, not really that different than what the plan was. Oh, the building. Ah, I see. You're right there. Yeah, that's not gonna... It's way too close, hey? Well... footpath all the way back to here maybe doubtful thinking that's just not going to be an option but not a lot of things with this game <laughs> okay let's try that again zoom out a little bit if i do that i know it's not connected oh it'll connect there though Oh, that's just a little stub of a road. Let me see. We can work on that. And I think we need a 
passes this point. All right. Cool. Now I can start. We are waiting. Oh, I don't have any signals in here. Which piece of braille are you going to? Going way up there. I think putting signals in here is going to be a smart thing to do now. <laughs> way I can have at least I can have more than one vehicle. One bit uh, track builder on most oh, sentences, wow. Is sorted as well. Come on. And you want something on this side as well. Well, I know that's splitting the track up, but we'll be fine. So you really want me to signal this as well, hey? Okay. Put another one there. Means you want one there. You're not gonna let me put one there. should be fine. So we can cooperate there. Two signals there. Which one was you? One was you? You're only working on two two now. I'll have to re <coughs> reassign these I guess. It's a little here we don't need that one. We'll get continued on here from there okay <clears throat> probably gonna end up having or not probably will end up and start working on this section of track so having that signaled is a good thing. Particularly, as I said before, concerned about this leg of this. This is going to be come in, pick up, and away you go. So that'll be uh, that'll be one of the last things that uh, they work on on this side. They are coming out here. Oh, fuel! I want some fuel. Getting close to sewing. There they go. Nice. So wing season is upon us. So it's done, so they should be able to come straight down here. That'll make things much faster. Helicopters make quick work of all of this stuff. Whoa, we have everything delivered. Nice. here and as soon as we get that we have power there and then we'll be able to find out if I can assign this or if this road cargo station needs to be replaced didn't completely forget about that one okay Do 
We need some people to finish that off. Lots of action there. And I said I was going to check on our happiness. Don't have a benchmark to compare that to, but we're sort of anywhere from 85. Yeah, 85. Looks like most of their complaints are dealt with, so they should be uh, rebounding. Now, um, the monuments. Two monuments that I was looking at. Way down at the other end. At least the one that I was considering. Oh. <sighs> Monuments. Still way down at the other end. It's just the other end isn't quite as far. Clickety click. Quite like this circle of heroes. And that'll fit in here. Nice. I, 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 I kind of like having it. I don't know if I put it on that side. Zoom in to get a little better picture of where that's, how that's laid out. It's not, uh, not square. I'd like to get it in the middle of the building from a being lined up perspective. Maybe this is, no, won't fit there. Oh, it'll go there, though. That kind of a cool spot. Now, in my mind, the, the here, I don't know what your thoughts are for the uh, who the heroes there are. The people that saved them, or the people that were inadvertently frozen to death. I mean, you could argue either way, quite honestly. Um, at any rate, it's a monument. something to remember that uh, our helicopters came in and got things done post haste I do want to uh, put another one up and I'm trying to remember where I where it was in the whole want something a little grander than that I don't know if a Red Army Memorial <laughs> is fitting for people that I think I had obelisk or the sorry my brain's uh, gone blank it was an obelisk in here I was looking at not the juice tower hmm where Need something a little grander than that. Just drawing a complete blank. This is crazy. Unless I've gone past it already, which is... Well, here we are. And I kind of like the idea of having them both on this side of the... Uh, <clears throat> the metro. Because then you can see it from the road as well as from the metro, so... I think that's, uh, that's a good thing. Get our temporary road in there, and we'll get the road gang working on both of those. Let's see how much time. 22 minutes left. See, I can just look at my wrist now. 
for how much time versus looking what time did i start again how did i when did i all that kind of stuff so um good it doesn't appear that we're blocking our metros anymore or at least not stopping their flow they're uh, they're going back and forth I'm hoping yeah we've got uh, almost we've almost filled <laughs> we have filled our aluminum and imagine that <clears throat> Yet something else that hasn't been built. Okay. It's all good. How is our chemical supply? No one on the way. Where are you picking up chemicals from? Well, I know where you're picking it up from, but. Deliver. Deliver. I didn't see a place for picking up chemicals. I suspect it's this one. That would be wrong. Hmm. I thought the uh, supply export were actually getting chemicals from here. So Lelona Warehouse 2. I shouldn't have closed the uh, supply export, should I? No. So Lelona Warehouse 2. Is that on my list? It is. Okay. And I think what I did was turned our foot. Yeah, we're trucking it in here, so we don't need to drop off here anymore. Did Grigor do that? We don't need to drop off chemicals. Or our fabrics. Okay. That's all good. Let's see, is anyone coming? Yep, yeah, they're bringing, bringing them now. So we should soon see. Chemicals showing up down there. And it's a bit of a moot point right now because <clears throat> we've got no place to store aluminum. It's all good. Now I'm starting to wonder, is it a good idea to, how important this would be to be paved? We've got a huge paving project up here, this end, so... Yeah, this one here. And we're starting to work on that one. Are we getting any materials out here? We are. Nice. Nine work days. But it's time to get buses on this. Only two. We need people, do we? Okay. Oh, and they were just looking for some asphalt. It's it's pronounced asphalt. I checked it. Uh, asphalt, I think, is just our our own colloquial. Collo yeah, there's the word. I'll let you look that one up because I'm not going to try to say it again. A uh, way of saying it here, and it just stuck with me. But the pronunciation is asphalt. Just thought I'd clear that up it's just something that i can't stop saying so you hear me say asphalt laugh along with me please huh. um yeah okay well we've got mm, lots of fields getting dealt with 
growing progress. Nice. And they're set to go deal with all the rest of them. Bigger fields. So we, we as long as uh, we can get this, <laughs> some electricity, and it works. If it doesn't work, then we'll, uh, we'll, we'll, we'll put something else in, but a different road. Yeah, I should have probably waited on building this till I confirmed that, but I'm not that smart, so. Don't, you can't get to any of these? Well, I know a group that can. Just like them to work on those other things first. Oh, not assigned. Guess I just assumed what I should do is not have them build that one or that one for the time being. Get this one finished. <clears throat> And they've got, they've got four to work on, so that's good. Yeah, and they've started in here. Nice. Okay. Like we're getting materials delivered for our monuments. Probably a little cheesy, but if you got a better suggestion, please let me know. Oh, and there was... There's three more deaths now. I don't know if that's attributable to the uh, the cold, cold, cold winter that we put them through, but when I checked uh, the save file initially, there was 34. And I've not been paying any attention. Thankfully, our fire departments are on it. Iron's going down. That's much of a concern. 2012. That's the year we're in. Okay, coming back. Fuel here for you. Oh, no, that's the top. Fuel here. Probably consider putting a few more monuments out as well. A few more, as in some? Yeah. The Red Star has become one of those. I'm just trying to get uh, the, uh, the passive... Passive uh, loyalty dealt with. Um, a lot of the other monuments that I use are uh, as much decorative as anything. They're they're effective, no doubt. Um, but they uh, in the right place. There's a bunch of the the smaller ones that uh, let's see where I can sneak. Them. seem appropriate there I don't know are, are decorative and I, and I like them I like the look of them to me it would you know having them in in places is uh, is a good thing monument building crew going so what I was talking about finish my sentences with is I tend to use a lot of Nika. Uh, I like that one. It's it's colorful, although I end up placing it backwards all the time because the lettering is supposed to face. Okay, let me show you what I'm talking about. The, uh, the lettering's on this side, not on this side, but 
when you get them close to a building in the pass this way and you want to sneak one in, I ended up forgetting about that half the time. And I place it this way, so it's... It, yeah. Anyway. Rambling about stuff that doesn't matter all that much, but... At any rate. Okay. Oh, there's a footpath there. That I don't need anymore. Okay. Some monumentization. There's a new word for you, Kaya. The only problem that I really see with me using these like this is the fact that I put a lot of the same monuments up all over the place. So, be that as it may, cities sort of take on a similar look when it comes to that stuff. It's a little, probably a little big for that area. As this one probably is as well. We will go in, but I don't know if I can get a footpath in there. Looks like I can. using the flags they don't they don't add a whole bunch but like i said before probably an episode or 10 ago uh i kind of like the uh the color that it adds sort of an official official flavor i'm running out of things to look at there so still on monument some of the other ones that i use a fair amount um where are they they were the small monuments and I wish I could remember who it was that uh, created them. I would give them a shout out, but I don't know for sure. These ones. Yeah, I use these ones quite a bit. They're, uh, you know, they've got, uh, you know, a decent amount. Is it is it max? No. I like them. They 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 fit they f they fit they fit in those those small places and uh, I think they just added something. Half the time I end up forgetting which one I just placed. I usually do two of them. after and then we'll uh, deal with that from there. Not sure any of these are going to fit fit in the space that collision not collision free but no collision that's the proper way to say that yeah I didn't realize it was as small as it was. It, uh, 
will work nicely there, I think. Little on the large side. Builder. Yeah. Where's my... Never remember where they are. <clears throat> the uh, playgrounds. use them a fair amount and I always forget where I put them they're probably right up front too right okay help me out you see it shout out Yep, there we are. I think having that right one at one end and one at the other is probably a... So they've got a star right there. Now putting one right in the middle is, is good. And you need something, something a little different. This is how you're the, the lone one on this side of the... Uh, can I get you to fit in there? Sock go flash green. Little playground. Okay. That's probably enough of that for now. If I haven't lost you yet, I've given you every opportunity. The footpath there is not done. That is. Okay, that's a problem. I believe that was the hospital, if I'm not mistaken. Yes. Oops. More oops. Mm -hmm. There and there. I want yes. There. Um, it's ever happened to you, certainly happened to me a few times where I place things and they put the, uh, the, the path in saying that yes, we can get there and they can't <laughs> for, for some reason. Um, this hospital isn't particularly accessible, is it? I mean, there's the roads, obviously. Uh, maybe we should get a path hooked up here. And even do one on that side. Yeah, wait there for... Uh, that many students yet just given this is that uh, the age of the people that moved in here and the age of the uh, their children so having uh, that many uh, no one going to school right now is not uh, could have sworn they could have got to school What are our unemployment numbers like? Pretty well employed. Okay, that's good. And I got two minutes and 37 seconds left. Yeah. 
This is going to need people. Are we getting anything in here? For now. Oops, this is what I was looking for. It's own internal storage, yeah, 16. So. Certainly not the max number of workers that we want to see. That'll be a fine tuning stage now that I think I've got most things settled down here now. Um, <laughs> just as I say, right. uh, where are you? Oh yeah, you can get out. It's just going to take you a minute. Relax, relax. It's all good. The Lona pump jack that should be covered. Yeah, he'll be moving along just fine in a minute. Oh, and we've only got two pieces of rail left to go. So you built that one. Let's get you building this one. And this one please and thank you all right well looks like we're back in the farming business so hopefully um let's see we didn't get this built yet is there anyone on their way no too many things too close to it to work on okay well <clears throat> we'll uh may have to uh, let the uh ground base co's Peter out of work for a short time so that they can get these other two projects dealt with this one being one of them I need need to know sooner rather than later so that'll be a thing for next episode thanks for hanging with me uh I appreciate you have yourself a wonderful day and we'll catch you in the next one cheers